I have this alloy here. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to build a container for this plant out of some cedar uh, leftover wood that we have from our fence building project. So this, as you can see, is like really, really nice, nice wood and it smells amazing too. And I'd like to make something out of it. So what I'm thinking is that I'm, what I'm thinking to do is I'm going to cut these in half width wise. So I'm going to have four pieces of wood and then I'm going to miter them just to make it look a little bit prettier than just doing butt joints. And then I have this one here that I'm also going to cut in half and I'm going, this is going to be my base. I have saved this mushroom container. So I'm going to build around this plastic container, black plastic container. <laughs> As you may have noticed, I am making this up as I go along. I am not following any how-to instructions, which would probably require me to buy lumber of a specific size or buy a container insert of a specific size. I am using my mushroom plastic insert as a starting point and building around it using wood that I already have. I have a general idea in my head of what I want this to look like. and. I am making it come together as I go. Making things up as you go has a bad reputation, but I think it's a good practice for building faith in your own abilities to make things work, even if you don't have every single detail figured out ahead of time. All you have to do is just start somewhere and build out from there. Because my box is small and the pieces fit together well, I don't actually need to use any nails or screws to put it together. I can get away with only using a good wood glue. This gives it a sleeker look before, because you can't see any fasteners. The box looks good from all sides and it is solid. alloy here, alloy, 
Aloe. 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 That's not a metal alloy. Aloe. Is that it's a metal a, alloy? It's an alloy. <laughs> okay. All right. So. Hmm. Okay. So. I've got this plant here. It's an alloy. Um, and I think... Start again. It's an aloe. 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 It's an aloe vera? Aloe vera, yes. Does it help to say aloe vera? No, not really. 